Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC. We're here at the Dell HPC Community Meeting in Austin, Texas, and I'm here with Adnan. How are you doing today, sir? Hello, Rich. I'm doing good. How about yourself? <laughs> good, good. You know, this has been a great meeting. I, there's something like 300 customers here, you know, a lot of people, a lot of interest. So along those lines, what are you hearing from customers this week? So uh, one of the things, you know, we've been hearing consistently is this flexibility in how they do HPC. For example, I'm sure you've heard already HPC in the cloud. Now, that was a theme that we've been hearing for the past several meetings. And, uh, you know, we've made these announcements on how we've got these partnerships going on with cycle computing or R systems. And, you know, so that's one of the direct outcomes of, uh, of the community example, you know. Uh, but what we're also hearing is they want to have um, different ways of leveraging HPC for what they do. For example, big data, you know, it's been talked about for a very long time. There's still two completely different work streams. You know, the scheduler, the job schedulers are different, the tools are different. They come in from different sort of angles, one from the enterprise side who work primarily with Java, then you've got the HPC researchers from academia who are looking at C and MPI and all of that. So how do we make both sides work together more efficiently? So, so that's you know what I'm hearing. And I think they want to be able to do all of this much more easily than they're doing today. And, and I hear this from both sides, both from the enterprise side as well as from the research side.